everybody, happy Friday. I wasn't sure how I was gonna be feeling today because I had a biochem exam from three to four and I thought it was gonna be really, really challenging, but it turned out to go pretty well as far as I know. I haven't got my score back yet, but once I do, I'll be sure to update you guys. But this is gonna be a little weekend in my life. I'm at my house, my home from, you know, not MSU, my real house, and with my dog. So basically, I'm just gonna be showing you guys what a weekend at home looks like for me. You'll get to see a lot of my adorable pup. I'm gonna be doing some errands and I also have to write another paper for my HPS class. So I'll be taking you guys along on all of that. For real, we have the most beautiful sunsets at my house and I'm gonna show you guys really quick. So we have some of the prettiest sunsets ever on my lake. It's not anything super crazy tonight, but still beautiful and you can see like how snowy it is it's crazy The game plan for tonight, things I'd like to get done, would be to do this radiology homework for my anatomy lab class, which is online. Um, I have to get dinner at 6.30 right now, by the way. And then I want to kind of clean up the house for my parents to make it like nice for when they get home from their trip. And then I forget what else I had to do. Oh yeah, I have to go to the gym, and then I also want to start working on my final project for my media and information class, which tonight I'd be working on making a WordPress site, so I'll show you guys all of that. So right now I just finished um, my contributions to our weekly slides for our meeting that is going to be Monday night. We're actually talking about like ethical questions and doing like some mock MMIs for the club that I'm in. It's a pre-health um, honor society at MSU. So I just finished um, adding some edits to the slides and it's 7.30 right now. I'm gonna go get some dinner. I think I'm gonna pick up Subway because I got like four hours of sleep last night. I'm really not in the mood to cook anything and yeah, that's really my only excuse, but I'm gonna go pick up Subway. Okay, so just as a little update, it's 11.15. <laughs> I got really carried away and like hooked on making that website for my school project. I mean, I kind of knew I would because I love like graphic design and like I made a whole new website for my club this year just because like I wanted it to look good. And I spent like days working on it. But anyways, so I made a WordPress site for kind of like my YouTube channel slash like maybe use it for blogging. I have to make like a certain amount of posts like to get like a minimum amount but he said even with that that's like minimum which would probably be like passing like a two point or something so that means i need to do like a lot more than that so i am going to be pretty active on there for the next like couple weeks till the semester's over so if you are interested in seeing my blog i will have it linked down below i'll probably be sharing like these videos as well as like extra content so if you're interested that would be a great place to go i'll give you guys a little like sneak peek right now all i've really done is like get the like layout how i want it and do like an about me page so sorry if lighting's kind of funky but this is basically what it looks like literally just like about me i have like my twitter and my most recent video there for youtube um, I'll have my Twitter link down below by the way as well. I also have to get more active on there for this project So feel free to follow me. I'm gonna post like polls and stuff on there as well as on my Instagram Okay, so now it is Saturday afternoon and right now I'm about to work on planning 
um, my study abroad trip that I'd go on once the program finishes. But I have to see if, like, how much it's all going to cost to see if it's actually doable. Um, my goal would be to be going to New Zealand after I finish my program in Australia for the month of July. So I'm working on planning that. If anyone has any study abroad tips or travel itinerary planning advice, be great. Please leave it in the comments. But that's what I'm working on right now. I'm making a Google Sheet and then I'm going to send it in a group chat that we have of people interested in going to New Zealand so we can all kind of collaborate together and do research because it is way too much for one person to do, especially not even knowing if we're actually going to use this, if it's like feasible for our budgets and everything. So we're going to try to get like a rough estimate of the total costs, including like flights, lodging, experiences, food, all that. So I'm going to just set that up really quickly and send that to everyone. And then the rest of the day, we're going to be doing errands pretty much, but some are fun. Like I like going to like Staples and Walmart and that kind of stuff because I always go to like either staples like this organizing like school stuff or in Walmart I look at like the throw pillows and we have to go to staples, Walmart, CVS, I have to get a car wash and I think that's everything but I'll take you guys along with me. Okay, so car wash done, Walmart done, but um, I was literally had to be in Walmart for like 40 minutes because the return took like 30 because the line was really long. And then they don't really, they're just like very understaffed, so it takes a long time, but it was still good. I got everything I needed and I'm not in a huge rush, so it didn't really matter. But um, now I'm about to go into Staples. It is in like a strip mall that has Target and Michaels. So that's kind of dangerous for me because I really want to go in but I have to resist because I really don't need to spend any more money so I'm just gonna get um, printer paper and ink from Staples so currently I am shoveling all this ice up for my parents cleaned this whole area but if you look over here, there's still quite a bit more that I need to do. Hi, Grace. All right, guys, I am sweating from uh, that shoveling. It's really hard when it's like ice, obviously, because it's like two inches thick of like ice, and you have to like. You get it, you probably shoveled if you live anywhere where it's snowy, but that was hard. I hope my parents appreciate it. Um, I just have to clean up the house a little bit before I pick them up. I'm gonna leave at 7.30 to pick them up and from the airport. And then probably just chill the rest of the night. I'm gonna just clean up the house a little bit and make some dinner. Are you happy after dinner? You're just the cutest thing. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys what I'm making for dinner. Um, basically, we have, we have these veggies. I'm gonna chop up some broccoli, asparagus, and probably half these little carrot chips. Then I'm currently defrosting this frozen pre-cooked shrimp. And for the shrimp, I'm gonna use this chili lime seasoning from Trader Joe's. I haven't tried it yet, but I've heard good things. Honestly, like, way more than I need, but I wanna cook them all, and I'm actually, since I'm home, I'll just leave whatever I don't finish for my family to enjoy. And I'm just gonna spray the pan with this, like, olive oil spray. In theory, this is lower calories but who really knows? Probably should have done the broccoli first because that takes longer to cook, but we'll just leave this on really low. She loves cooking dinner. It's a favorite, favorite time. 
I swear like 90% of this vlog is probably my dog, so sorry if you don't like dogs, but if you don't like dogs, a little questionable. All right, we've got all the veggies in the pan. So I'm just gonna move them around a little bit to get them all a little coated in that oil that I sprayed. And then I'm gonna add the pepper now, but it's better to wait to salt your stuff until it's like almost done. Cover it, cause that's gonna kind of give it a um, steamed effect basically, which is better for your veggies. So we'll check in in a sec. So to season the shrimp, like I said, I'm using this chili lime seasoning. I'm not big into like spice, so like, or like heat, I guess. So I'm not gonna do too much, but we'll test the waters, I guess, and see. Alrighty, dinner is served. Again, we get the shrimp with the chili lime seasoning. Oh, getting steamy. And mixed assortment of veggies. I probably won't eat all of that. This looks like a lot of food. All right, so yeah, dinner's done. I have to go pick up my parents in about 20 minutes, so I'm gonna eat really quickly. And then I think I'm gonna end off this vlog here. I hope you enjoyed this week weekend in my life or day in my life at home. It's been awesome to relax and hang out with my pup. <laughs> Say bye, Grace. <laughs> Clearly not very enthusiastic. But I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm gonna have all my socials linked below, that blog that I mentioned, my Twitter and my Instagram. Instagram's definitely the main place to connect with me so I can get input from you guys about what kind of videos you wanna see. And other than that, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.